Hello everyone, so uh, today I'm going to show you the best extensions I have found uh, for Google Chrome uh, which uh, most of them you can download from the Chrome Web Store right there um, so yeah I'm going to show you all of them right now um, some might not be useful depending on what websites you visit and uh, what programs you use so uh, yeah if you go to tools extensions you can see the ones I have uh, installed so the first one is Adblock Plus uh, it's really simple it just blocks ads on uh, all the websites you don't really need to mess with the settings just the default works well then the next one you can see uh, right here on the list is called Better Battle Log uh, and this if you don't play Battlefield 3 it's uh, useless for you but yeah if you you'd, uh, if you do play the game you can see here it says uh, Better Battle Log Options and you get a bunch of new options. You can change the theme. Um, just it's amazing. So if you do play Battlefield, just download that. Just search for it on uh, Google. Better Battle Log and download that right there. It's not in the Chrome Store. Yeah, the next one is Black Menu, which uh, is really nice. If you use Google and Google Services. Uh, it's really neat. So what you have here is uh, this little icon, and if you click on it, uh, you get all the Google services right there. So you can do a, Google, uh, a quick Google search. Uh, you can search for images, news, places, whatever. You can see your Google Plus notifications, and you can search on Google Plus. You can translate uh, text. You can see the map, search the map, search apps, music books, movies, search YouTube videos, news, check your Gmail, Google Drive, and your calendar. Uh, so that's really, really nice. It's a really fast way to uh, just check on all your Google services. So yeah, that's called Black Menu. You can download that if we that's all of them. And then the next one is called uh, Chime or Chime. I don't know how you say it, uh, which is really nice. You can. Uh, basically get notifications like you would on your smartphone uh, for the most popular sites like Gmail, Reddit, Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus, Flickr uh, so yeah if you get a new uh, email for example a uh, notification right here on the bottom will show up and you get a little one right there you can see I got one unread uh, email I can clear that out uh, so that's really nice as well and then uh, uh, hover zoom uh, it's just a fast way to uh, open websites I mean images on websites so yeah now it's not working I don't know I'm trying to show you this and it's not working maybe I disabled it no. well it does work I don't know why it's not working right now <laughs> it should work it always works Okay, whatever. It doesn't work. But when it does work, it's really nice. You can uh, blacklist uh, websites and stuff like that. You can check the options for yourself. And then the next one is called uh, Media Hint, which is uh, for users outside the United States. So if you're in the US, this is not going to apply to you. But uh, say you're outside the US and you want to watch a Hulu video. Most of the time you can say uh, you can only watch this video on the US or whatever. So here with Media Hint, you can uh, choose any video. See Family Guy right there. And I want to play this episode. Normally it wouldn't show, so now you see it works perfectly, loads just fine. As it would uh, if you were living in the US. So that's really, really nice really cool it's not from the chrome store as you can see right there so you have to search for it uh, media hint oh hunt yeah it's right there you have to uh, just download it it's really simple then the next one I have installed is called reddit enhanced enhancement suit uh, so once again if you don't visit reddit it's gonna be useless for you but if you do uh, you should definitely download this uh, extension it gives you a bunch of new options 
Uh, I mean, there's so many. It makes uh, Reddit so much better that uh, it's not even it's not even funny. Reddit hands. Search for it on uh, Google. I mean, you can see the features right here. You can switch accounts, show common karma, user hider, filters. Uh, it's really nice. So yeah. And then the last one is uh, called YouTube Options, which is one of my favorites actually because I'm always watching YouTube videos, and uh, you can uh, change the viewing size of the video. I mean the size of the actual video and then you can change the viewing quality um, so let me show you that right now whatever I'll just click any random video you can see the the video size just changed by itself to 720 and then the quality 180 uh, right there uh, you can hide the in video ads or whatever and you can change the autoplay, I have it to uh, disable autoplay. So if you have lots of videos, you open lots of videos at the same time, right there. It won't play automatically; it just stops, but it does buffer. So once you uh, want to play, uh, it's loaded already for you. So that's really nice. Uh, you can change the layout of YouTube. You can hide. Uh, the header, the guide. It's really nice. And you can choose different sites as well, other than YouTube. So, yeah, these are my uh, top extensions for you to use uh, on Google Chrome. Uh, if you like this video, make sure to subscribe. And uh, if you have any questions or uh, suggestions, just write a comment down below. And thanks for watching.